children welcome in shruti's classroom children in last some lectures we have completed our lesson number 2 and exercise on it today we are going to start a new lesson lesson number 3 the name of lesson is eating habits of animals so let us start children always see various types of animals around us animals are living things and that need food to grow and survive food gives energy for their growth and to stay healthy plants can make their own food but animals cannot make their own food it depends on plants and animals so now all of you are thinking that what do animals eat animals have different food habits according to their eating habits so animal can divided into three classes or category so let's we see first one is herbivores are also called as herbivorous animals next one is carnivores also called as carnivorous animals and third one is omnivores also called as omnivorous animals children let's we see all these classes in detail one by one first one is herbivores herb means plant and horus means eater animals that eat only plants are called as herbivorous animals or herbivores they are also called as plant eaters or plant eating animals for example cow deer elephant rabbit and kangaroo etc children next class is carnivorous animals carnivorous animals are the animals that hunt and eat flesh of other animals are called as carnivorous animals they are also called as flesh eaters or flesh eating animals for example crocodile leopard lion tiger wolf etc these are generally wild animals and they hunt and eat flesh of other animals class is omnivorous animals animals that eat plants and flesh of other animals are called as omnivorous animals they are generally get their food easy why right? because they eat plant and flesh of other animals so they get their food easy children we are also animals means all human beings are animals so all we are included in omnivorous categories why because we all eat vegetables grains and flesh of other animals so let's we see the examples of omnivorous animals omnivorous animals are pig rat cockroach these are the omnivorous animals so children let's take recap what we see today we learn three classes of animals first herbivorous animals second carnivorous animals and third omnivorous animals children i hope all of you understood these classes of animals today we stop here next point we will see in next lecture till that time bye bye see you